that sounds Christmassy. It's on film now. I can not. What the hell? Hello and welcome to Vlogmas 2023. This is the first time I'm doing Vlogmas and I'm literally so excited. I'm really not the best when it comes to vlogging, but this is just me documenting my life, I guess. I've got some amazing things going on for December this month. Tomorrow I am going on a little girl's trip to Bratislava and of course I'm going to take you along with me so I'm probably not going to be able to like post um December 2nd and December 3rd but I will film it but I won't be able to like upload it and maybe I'll just like combine those two days I know that um vlogmas is like really stressful for some vloggers I guess or like content creators and obviously it is stressful because you have to like film and then basically edit the same day and then upload for the next day which can be really stressful but I'm really up for the challenge but I'm also not going to uh, give myself a hard time if I miss a day or maybe combine two days in one vlog I'm really not trying to like stress myself out with this I'm literally just doing this for fun and I want this to stay fun so yeah this is my plan for vlogmas this is not me trying to get another burnout this is literally just for fun This is my makeup. It is, as always, super simple, super light. Um, the only thing that I really do and switch out is my lipstick from time to time. Sometimes I wear red lipstick, but today I felt like this brown lipstick. So, and look at this cute! The key is so cute. It's just literally the cutest being ever yeah you are also i feel like lighting makes such a difference when i was doing my makeup earlier i felt like i'm doing such a bad job and it literally looks like i'm not wearing any makeup but now i moved to the bathroom and i'm feeling myself like i look cute today so now we have to somehow fix whatever's going on here and i am um, I am going to wash my hair in the evening, so I'm not going to bother too much. But what I like to do, since I got back from Amsterdam, I got this uh, rosemary oil and I heard it's like really good for your scalp, so I like to apply it like every single day now to keep my hair like growing and nourish my hair and scalp. So I'm doing that and then we are going to put my hair into a bun. So my hair is already kind of like oily because I've applied some oil yesterday as well and the day before I think. But I kept it in a bun the whole time. So I really want like healthier scalp. I have really dry scalp naturally so I have to do a lot to my scalp so my hair can grow. Merry vlog, that's the early vlogging. Yes. Super Good morning. morning. Good morning. Good morning. Could make some pancakes. Pancakes? Yeah. Pancakes. Pancakes. Okay, that was weird. 
<laughs> so, but what I like to do is using the Echo Styler and one of those little brushy brushies because I don't like going in there with my fingers. So I use the applicator thingy. And this is literally what I'm doing like every single day. And then mix it with some water. What's she doing? <laughs> And then just go over my hair, brush it through, sleek it out. I also take one of those brushes, which have like really soft bristles, to like really sleek out my hair, brush it back. So, and sometimes I just break this part down. I did that so often, so I'm just like going to create a normal bun today. And that's it. And now we need to obviously fix the baby hair situation. So I'm gonna first brush my baby hairs out. Take some of the gel, brush them on my baby hair. And you have to use a lot to make them stay all day. Then we take this bristle thingy and then just brush it in place. And this is it. <laughs> Bon appetit, my loves. My loves. We are going to enjoy the pancakes and what are we watching? Candy Cane Lane. Candy Cane Lane, that sounds Christmassy. So I almost forgot to open up my advent calendar, so we're gonna go and do that right now. My mom is just the most, like she's just the best person ever and she made me an advent calendar she does that every single year and she just fills up the calendar with like a lot of beauty stuff and i'm so excited to open up the first like little doors and then she also got me this kinder advent calendar which i love kinder this is my favorite chocolate ever and i i mean it's not just only for like kinder or like children's i feel like it's also for grown-ups like it's the best chocolate ever i love it so yeah this is the advent calendar and she got that box from the body shop which she bought like a couple years ago but then she decided to just keep the box and then fill it herself every single year for me so i'm so excited let's do these and this is what it looks like it's a little bit damaged on the sides but i might just like glue that back on but this is so cute okay let's open up the first one i got it right here oh my god i feel like it's gonna fall all over me maybe i should lay this whole thing down okay let's do this like as always there's some chocolate in there i love those as well this is just the rum or coconut chocolate and oh my god i think we're gonna do some face masks today so this is like one of those sheet masks and i love them so much so i think we're gonna do that today like do some little like skincare stuff so whenever i'm done with one of those boxes i'll just turn it around and at the end of everything it's like says something i forgot what it said but like it's always a surprise every single year because <laughs> i can never remember but like it does say something and of course we have to open the chocolate calendar as well this time this is just like a mini chocolate calendar which i'm not too mad about because i usually never have like enough space and the other calendar is so huge itself so i'm really happy about that one uh, it's still sealed so I need some scissors and just open up the plastic and let's try and find number one. Can you find it before me? Oh, I got it. <laughs> it's right over here. It's just like a little chocolate egg. Which is funny because it's Christmas, but like at least it's got like something like Christmassy around it. <laughs> and I just remember as a little child, I got like always so excited about like advent calendars. And like now I tend to like forget 
that I have one, um, which is actually quite fun because after like a couple of days I get to open like, I don't know, five boxes of my calendar, so that's my favorite chocolate ever. Mm -mm -mm. You said my avocado dips are the best, so... They are the best. Stop recording when I said that or did you start? <laughs> I started recording when you said that so we know it's it's on film now, like the whole world is gonna know this, that your guacamole is the best one out there. <laughs> so as I mentioned earlier, I am going on a little girls trip. It's just one night, but we are going to Bratislava. Like not directly Bratislava, like our Airbnb is a little bit outside of Bratislava. It's in a little nice cottage and I'm so excited but obviously we have to pack for this so I've already prepared everything I'm gonna bring which is not going to be too much as I don't even want to bring a suitcase or anything I'm just gonna bring my big shopper bag um that one just in case I'm going to shop something I'm also bringing my cute little tote bag and it has all the dog breeds on it and I just feel like it's so cute I love it so much so I'm just gonna bring that as well. And then we are obviously gonna bring some pajamas. Those are like very Christmassy, which I love. Some underwear always packed twice. <laughs> and I am going to bring an extra top for this. And then some hygienic stuff. And I am also bringing those uh, face masks. We are exactly five girls. If I didn't miscount, which I hope I didn't. Uh, but I thought it would be so cute if we would just like have a little face mask, like evening or something. I don't know if the girl's up to, but like I'm just bringing them in case. And yeah, all my hygienic stuff, hairbrush, uh, face wash, deodorant, dental wash, my um, contact lens solution, my contact lens box. And yeah, all of that. And of course, we can never forget the iPhone cable so I think I'm like the only one who's using an iPhone out of the five girls but I'm not entirely sure but like that's very important right now and of course I have to charge my camera I will bring you along and I will pack my makeup but I will pack that in the morning because I'm gonna use it obviously in the morning so all of that is going in there and I'm also gonna bring this like mini perfume which I got for free yeah it smells really good but like I don't feel like bringing a whole bottle hope everything fits in here Okay, can I close that? Is that possible? Oh, perfect. Okay, amazing. We have my hygienic stuff and like everything in here. Um, then my makeup will go in here. And oh yeah, those makeup wipes. I think I might just have them in here as well. And yeah, I think I'm all set. And I've already prepared what I will wear tomorrow, which will be just this turtleneck pullover, which is a little bit of a thicker material and then those white leg pants and underneath I'll just wear my uh, long sleeved shirt and then some tights underneath as well because it's gonna be very cold and oh my god look at my socks like Dachshund Christmas socks they're just the vibe I love them and yeah this is everything I am going to bring it's literally just staying overnight so one of my friends she made a whole website and she just listed down all of the agendas and like everything we're gonna do which gets me so excited literally and like i love the effort she was bringing in i will show you in a second okay the lighting is a little bit off here it looks really weird and bluish but yeah it is what it is so <laughs> Like she, that girl, she made a whole website. I can not. Like everything we're gonna do, like even like what we should pack and like she put down the weather. Like this is crazy. Like how much effort she put into this. And she made a whole countdown as well. And it's currently 18 hours and 20 minutes away <laughs> until we're gonna go. So what the hell, like I love that so much. Okay, um, I'm just rethinking my choice of trousers because um, my friend who booked the cottage on the Airbnb, she just got a message saying that we should wear snowshoes because there is like a lot of snow there. 
so yeah i only have like this one pair of snow boots or like boots like winter boots in general and i feel like styling wise this would not go well with the um white leg trousers so maybe i just wear some jeans but like my black jeans and the washer currently i mean i just literally put them in the washer like 10 minutes ago so yeah they weren't that dirty you know whenever like clothes end up on your chair and you're never sure if they're clean or not or like you know but i feel like they weren't dirty like i just remember wearing them once so maybe I mean, they should be fine i'll wear them tomorrow let's see the guacamole is done Ooh, look at this masterpiece good job my love good job Ooh, it's crap the tortilla chip. Oh yeah. 